Hi, Mike from the Rural Montana family. It is the day after Christmas and just like everybody else we got the Christmas update a couple days ago and uh, today is a good day to go test the FSD Beta 10.8 update. We got a little more snow overnight again here and throughout the day. Um, we had some snow on Christmas Eve and I already kind of played a little bit with it but uh, well today is a good day we got some decent snow here taking it out and see if FSD beta actually works on a snow covered road currently we have not really any snowfall there's some flakes coming down but not bad so we will go down our road here and see how FSD beta does, if it even does at all. Well, I guess first we gotta dig out the car. So let's start removing snow. All right, off we go. And it's running way up, oh, there it goes. It's running way right, way right. We're actually running in the deep snow. Oh, and there was a snow berm and it hit it. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, uh, oh, okay, I think, uh, up. There we go. I don't think uh, we can handle it. And here it goes again. It goes right into the ditch. So. And the wipers just keep going and going because it's on test novation, so I have no control over the wipers. There. Let's see, go around the turn. And let's see if we can engage it again, maybe. Now it tells us all the steer unavailable. It doesn't, it doesn't tell us what's going on, but it's not gonna give us back. Full self-driving, unavailable, poor weather detected. There's no poor weather whatsoever. <laughs> there we go, let's engage. And it goes right away for the ditch again. It can't tell the difference. It's all white, ah, there's the ditch. It was about to suck us in. There's tracks here and my eye can see the difference. There we go again. We were about to go out again. I can see the difference, but the car cannot. And so that's obviously a full self-driving again. Look, 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 look. Up. There it almost went. I mean, there was even a mailbox there and it went for it. And again, there we go. Up. Almost sucked us in again. So, full self-driving and snow doesn't work. And it's not even snowing right now and like, there's no issues with, uh, with uh, being able to see. Uh, it keeps sucking it right over. There is uh, about six inches of snow before the taller berm. Whoa, he went right for it there. And it's super slick out too, and it's uh, still going full blast. Um, it chose to go 25, it's actually 35 mile an hour speed limit here, but it chose to go 35 or 25 or 26 because of my offset that's programmed. There's deep snow, there is six inches of snow right there. 
and it's going right for the ditch there again. We'll try again. Okay, now we're in the middle. Okay, now it's more on the left. Ah, <clears throat> uh, ah, uh, oh, we were about to go into the left there. Let's do it again. Now we're going right again. I don't know what that left one was and here we go six inches of snow once you hit that snow that pulls you out no matter what there's no tesla something that can do anything it just pulls you off the road that's just how it is okay we're engaged oh, and it just shoots right for the side there let's try again and again it goes right out there I <laughs> so it just keeps going let's see here we gotta oh we don't get it it show, doesn't show us that it would like us to do that let's try there we go yeah it has no clue where the right side is off the road and there we're in the snow We're in the snow, but uh, uh, there it started going. Uh, okay, one more time. It is driving in. Oh, uh, yeah. It is very far right. And here, oh, uh, it's in the snow, and there we're going right for the ditch. So, all right, I don't think we need to go any further here. We'll go a little bit, uh, there's a turnaround up here where we can turn around. But... Uh, uh, almost sucked us in the ditch. <laughs> all right, we got it back out barely. I had to turn the wheel quite a bit and uh, yeah, play with the accelerator a little, trying to get it out, but yes, um, well, full self-driving is not working out here. So if you have snow covered roads like this with this uh, flat light kind of deal, I mean, it's not sunny and bright, maybe that would change it, but that is the sunny and bright may not be the common went to driving anyway it will be more weather like this here um, so the going through the snow is not really an issue I mean we got six inches of snow here we're just driving around that's not the problem but the full self-driving pulling way too far right and uh, once it starts sucking a car in you're just gonna go there's nothing you can do about it that is just plain old physics. So now let's see. Got a car up there. It's super slick out too today, so we're gonna get sucked in really quick. Let's see if we can catch up a little. There, now it has a car in front. Oh, it slows down and <laughs> I didn't even have to pull. Oh, oh, it just wants to go over there. And immediately, it just jerks it right over. Every time. There's no way. It doesn't even follow this car in front of us. The car in front of us is about in the middle of the road. Which is a good place to be. <laughs> but as soon as I engage, it just pulls way over to the right. So and uh, yeah we would end up in the ditch here so well we're going back home I think without FSD at this point the car has been driving on this road before it was completely snow covered um, while it was, it's a dirt road and uh, the car done pretty good and even though it all looks kind of brownish when it's uh, a dirt road even over to the sides and stuff but it did pretty good but now 
it cannot see the difference uh, in snow depth here. It doesn't see what I see as a human or it cannot identify what I see as a human anyway. Oh, there's a little traffic there. So, yeah, you probably can see it in the camera. You can see the tracks and where people are going and stuff, but the car doesn't know the difference. It, uh, it, I don't know what it looks at, what it sees as the side of the road, but it keeps pulling so far right, it's unbelievable. Um, for uh, as a who as a human obviously in conditions like this you kind of stick to the middle of the road and you pull over as traffic approaches you but the car doesn't know that the car just is just programmed to go right 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 and that is a big problem can't do that this will suck us in the ditch which means we will crash and uh, Elon Musk said the car is programmed not to crash. That is the goal here. Well, this car would crash under these conditions here. So in any event, well, we'll go back home uh, since we figured out that FSD is worthless in uh, conditions like this, even though vision is good. Actually, it's real good but the roads are snow covered. So give us a thumbs up for this video. I mean, we risked our car out here, <laughs> almost getting sucked into the ditch. Who knows what's in there, big rock and damaging the suspension. So definitely give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so yet, subscribe to our channel, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the future videos we'll be taking this car out again maybe not under extremes like this but under partially snow covered roads here in the next few days so make sure you got you got the subscribe button there that it hit it and uh, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of those videos thank you for watching goodbye